So I'm curious and I am going to allow you to school me if you can. I'm going to tell you what I know. You're going to correct me where I'm wrong. And I'm talking about M Visa. Okay. So I'll tell you what I do know. I do know that M Visa is part of the Visa family. So it's a name you know, you trust, you've interacted with probably all your money life. Okay. What does the M stand for? In my world, you can correct me. It stands for Magic, Mambayote, Madoido. So for me, it is Magic Visa, Mobile Visa, uh, Madoido Visa, Mambayote Visa. So that's for me what it is. And the reason I call it that is because it, the first feature that I love is the fact that you pay using a QR code. Uh, what is QR code? Can I, can I demonstrate with sounds? You know the way you go to um, Zucchini? I understand like right now, M Visa is demonstrating and alive and well at Zucchini. You know, they'll go, do, do, do. With M Visa, you'll go, do, and then you pay. So it doesn't matter how many things you're buying, 15 things, do, 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 do. When they're done, you're like, um, I'm ready to pay now, do, done. It's literally magical, okay? So the beautiful thing is the money that you use when you're transacting with M Visa is literally money in your current account. It works very much like your debit card. So literally, it's not a mobile wallet. No, no, no. You don't pull money out of your current account into a wallet and then transact with it. No, it literally just sits in your own bank account and that's where you transact from, okay? You can actually, you know, pay for goods and services from everywhere, government to, I don't know, B2B, bank to bank. If your bank is already connected, it works that way, okay? So like I said, I'm gonna tell you what I've heard and what I'm fascinated by, and then you're gonna correct me and also tell me what you've heard, all right? The other thing I do know about M Visa is that we're very much part of the big starters on M Visa because it rolled out um, in India, then Kenya, then Uganda, then Rwanda. So we were number two. However, so that you can know that M Visa is Mamboyote Visa, do you know how many countries M Visa already is in? It's Kenya, Uganda, India, Pakistan. I checked Vietnam, Kazakhstan. I couldn't believe it. Um, did I already tell you Pakistan? Yes. It's just so many countries and it's the same thing. Remember, it's just your your current account, it's the same way you use your debit card, your Visa debit card, and use QR code. However, and I say this just because I think um, Visa is very much today and tomorrow and not yesterday, it, you can actually use it if you have a feature phone on USSD. But uh, let me just say nicely, mm -mm, watch out, migrate, <laughs> find a smartphone and let's do this. I don't think you'll get the cool effect of everything that M Visa promises you if you don't have a smartphone. I'm not saying you can't use it. I'm just saying, come on, come on, get the right thing, all right? Um, I'll tell you what I am curious about. I'm curious to know where I can use it. I'm curious to know which banks have obviously gotten themselves on the system so that if I'm banking with you, then I know that I am M Visa enabled. And I'd like to say here and now, if maybe in a week's time when I come back and I tell you what I truthfully know about M Visa, not this conversation I'm having because I'm curious, um, maybe if your bank's not ready, you need to say goodbye and find a bank that is. Maybe, yeah, yes. Um, and the other thing that I find fascinating about um, M Visa is the fact that it's not just a Kenyan issue. So, um, and, and this is something I keep repeating, but I'm going to because when I found out this, I was like, whoa. So um, Visa announced the expansion of M Visa to 10 markets earlier this year. And I've told you about India, Kenya, Rwanda, Egypt, Ghana, Indonesia, uh, Nigeria, Pakistan, and Vietnam. There you go. I know you're sitting there thinking, now Dubai, yeah, they need probably to, you know, hook up with the rest of us and get with it. So like I said, I'm curious. I feel that M Visa is a sort of thing we've been waiting for just because it's cool. And I don't think there's anything wrong with admitting that you love your mobile transactions and you're doing, you know, payments to be cool. There's nothing wrong with that. And I think it's cool. And I think it's the sort of thing you've probably been waiting for because you're so tired of um, clunky systems that have too many stops to pay. <laughs> there's some people who catch feelings when I go there, so I won't, okay? All I'm saying is, this is what I've heard. And if you think you've heard something else, uh, let me know. If you think I'm wrong, let me know. 
and Mvisa, if you're listening, I am open to being corrected, okay? Thank you.